Melody Weintraub, and today we're going to learn how to draw cylinders. Today we're going to learn how to draw a cylinder. And to draw a cylinder, we need to be able to draw two ellipses and connect them by straight lines. An ellipse is a flattened circle. As you can see, the shape of this is a circle. However, when I turn the angle of this toilet paper roll, the circle flattens. And this flattened circle that you see right now is an ellipse. So that's what we're going to draw first. An ellipse is a flattened circle that is curved on the ends. The ends do not come to a point. They are a curve because on a cylinder all of the curves will be the same. And whichever ellipse you make first, that will determine the curve for all the other ellipses to follow. Now you might want to practice drawing several ellipses. down and draw another identical ellipse below the first ellipse. Make sure that it's wider in the center and more narrow on the ends and that the ends do not come to a point. They are curved. Now connect this ellipse to the ellipse that's above it with a straight line. You have now drawn a cylinder. To make it look more like a cylinder, you can erase the top line and now you can see it. Now we're gonna draw this simple bottle and we're gonna draw the lid first, a small ellipse, for the top of the lid and then a small ellipse for the base of the lid and these ellipses should look exactly alike. Same curve. Connect with a straight line. And now we're going to draw the top of the bottle portion by making a larger ellipse here making the same size ellipse at the bottom or the base of the bottle and connecting it with a straight line. Now I can erase the top of that ellipse and erase the top of this ellipse. Now something that you should make note of is if you want to put any kind of graphics or a label on this bottle, you'll need to follow the same curve. So here's the curve we've already established by this ellipse. We'll have the same curve here for the top of the label 
the same curve for the base of the label, the graphics, which will also follow the same curve. Now here is a drawing that I've just started of a Campbell's soup can. And if you'll look, the words are written on the same curve as this ellipse. All of the words take the same curve. And all of these words are written on the same curve.